there is a member who for any reason wanted to change the family they belonged in, how would you approach this issue? The first thing I do is I'd approach the person and ask them why they want to change. And then I talk about it with the fam heads to see if like it's possible if it could change. But if the problem persists and the person like the GBM or doesn't want to be in that fam anymore, I'll switch them to another fam. Um, for your second question, will there's gonna be new families every year and executive board members and GBM How do you handle parents who show more fam spirit for the past fam than their current fam? And also, how do you handle GBM and TV parents? For the parents, I think the first thing I do is probably approach them and ask them, I mean, not ask them, but remind them of what their position is as a fam head and also um, kind of remind them of how it looked like if they didn't have any pride in their own family and how it kind of affect the rest of the fam. And then for the GBMers, I, I'd remind them that, I'd tell them about like fam bam or coin wars or even like the fam trophy at the end and I remind them that if they still like continue to have more pride for another, for like a fam, if they're one of their old past fams, it won't be as helpful or like it won't, be as good for their fam and might affect the placements of the fam trophy. Okay, for your third question, why do you think that activities belong within AFSA's internal branch? I believe activities belongs within AFSA's internal branch is because we're focusing more on trying to connect everyone together and the, like through these activities or like these icebreakers or the fam bam and all that stuff. We're trying to bring, like, create the community, like, closer together and represent, like, what AFSA is, like, all about. Okay, and then other students, questions? Yeah. Um, can you elaborate on how you want to implement more comp competition between fans? And um, would you think that this will bring AFSA together or grow them apart? The increase in increase in competition and will it cause them to grow apart? So it's two questions, right? It's, it's all really real. Can you elaborate on how you would want to implement a little more competition between fam heads and uh, wouldn't you think, or would you think that this will bring, after, would, and would you think that AFSA will bring, um, oh my gosh. <laughs> and would you think that this will bring AFSA together or grow them apart? Sorry. With the fam heads, I kind of just want to do competitions that'll make them feel a little more involved in the fam system because throughout this year, I kind of noticed like the fam, like the fam heads were kind of just there and it kind of made me like feel sad because I was like, oh, like, you know, like this is their fam too and like I want them to be like just as involved and like create like, like friendly competition. And as for like the whole like, will the increased competition cause like separation? I think it will, but not in a way where APSA as a whole will be like divided. Rather, I think I think a, fr a little friendly competition is fun. And I think that at the end of the day, like we're still like one community and I think we can all agree on that. And yeah, that's it. And last question. So uh, imagine if one of the fam heads drops from APSA, how would you increase morale for kids um, of that family with one less? One less fam head. Wow, I think this is a lot where I'm like, wow. I think I'd remind them like how far they've come, like even like even with the with the fam head and then how far they will continue to go even without the fam head. And I'd also remind them that like where this is still like a fam like competition and they're all still working together for the same kind of goal.